Oh. So, is that some class that you went to where you learned that, or how do you know that? Mr. Savage, objective form. The witness, Florida Statute 119. By Mr. Master Marco, Q119? Uh, yes, sir. Q, do you know what section it is? Let me ask you, did anyone, to your knowledge, because this apparently was turned over some time before there was ever a complaint by MS. Higgins or Mr. Tucker, okay, are you aware of why the state's attorneys didn't try to get that tape back, or go to the judge and say, hey, this was not released properly, we want this turned back over to us. Do you know why they didn't do that? Mr. Savage, object to form. The witness, I would have no idea and would not even begin to try to speculate or answer as to why the state did or did not do something. By Mr. Mastro Marco, Q right. Okay. So, if the state wasn't supposed to have this tape to begin with, why did that become the center of an investigation of my client? Mr. Catanzaro, objection. Mr. Savage, objective form. Mr. Mastro Marco, let me rephrase it, okay? By Mr. Mastro Marco, Q, if the state wasn't supposed to turn it over in the first place, and yet they did, why would that become the center of an investigation surrounding my client? Mr. Catanzaro, objection. Mr. Savage, objective form. The witness, do you want me to answer? Mr. Savage, I can't answer it. I'm just objecting to form for the record. If you can understand the question and formulate a response, go for it. The witness, again, the question makes the assumption that the state was not supposed to have it or turn it over. Again, I can't speak to what the state was supposed to have or what they're obligated to turn over. By Mr. Mastro Marco, Q okay. So, you never knew one way or another then if the state was supposed to have that or not, or turn that over? I know, sir. What I know is that they were given it and they just gave it to defense as part of discovery, which is what resulted in the complaint being filed. Q and then was there ever a ruse that was actually done? Mr. Savage, object to form. The witness, in the history of law enforcement, I assume so. By Mr. Mastro Marco, Q in this case, I can't speak to the entire case. If you're, if you're asking if the ruse to stop Detroit was ever conducted, not to my knowledge, no. Q okay. So, it was statements made on this that were part of an investigative strategy to try to get a thumbprint from this Detroit. Is that right? A uh, yes, sir. Q now, are ruses legal? A uh, yes, sir. Q are ruses used by the Monroe County Sheriff's Department? A uh, yes, sir. Q are reasons important for the investigators or detectives in order to identify dangerous